Hey guys, welcome to episode 4 of the Soul Survival series. I just wanted to take a quick moment to say thank you for 200,000 subscribers. I would say that I didn't expect hitting 200,000 subs, but if I'll be honest, I didn't think I'd have any following whatsoever on YouTube. I didn't think I'd ever reach 1,000 subs, 100 subs, anything like that. I just didn't think I'd be able to do this and entertain so many people for so long. I don't know if people typically do 200k sub specials because I feel like the next milestone after 100,000 is 250,000 since it's a quarter way to a million subs. So thank you everyone, I really appreciate it. I don't know if people typically do 200k sub specials because I feel like the next milestone after 100,000 is 250,000 since it's a quarter way to a million subs. But regardless, I've already recorded half of the video, I just need to record the other half and then edit the entire 200k sub special. This might take a little while though since I do have a lot on my plate at the moment. Uh, I'm even planning on moving out in around three to four months from now, so that's even more work but i am working on something and it will eventually come out i just don't know exactly when but yeah thank you all for 200,000 subscribers i really appreciate it i can't thank you all enough enough of me talking let's just get into the video i guess what i'll do is just pvp do a bit of scrap farming so i can research the bolty and the adex this is where this guy died what do you have nothing sar guy is over towards the mining oh he's right there i see him Oh, yikes. What? There's another star guy? Where? Well, we got him. I don't know why he pushed up that way. There's another guy inside of this base who might peek from the top. Well, we got another SAR, if I can bring this back to base. All right, I think we're fine. A new Revy, and actually, you know what I didn't have? I didn't have coffee can helmet, so I'm gonna research that real quick. That is a score. But uh, yeah, that's one way to start off this episode. Not as intense as last time. Here, I have two walls right there. There we go, and I don't need that box. All right, let's go to train yard. Uh, another thing as well is the Chinook crate, but I haven't seen a single Chinook crate around the map at all this wipe. I guess I'll have to pay a little bit more attention to the Chinook next time it's out. Supply drop? Okay. Uh, well, I don't know where I want to throw that at. This That's kind of not good. I could throw it in the water, although I think if it lands in the water... Yeah, you need a scuba suit. That's what you need. I may have to go to barrels and start hoping I can get a scuba suit. Well, all I really need is actually just a tank, so hopefully I can get one soon. Uh, of course, I got diving goggles or whatever they're called. Bolty? Heli's not out, so this guy's maybe out PvPing unless he's roof camping. That definitely does look like a roof camper base. Oof. I am not going up there if he is roof camping with a Bolty. I really wanted to follow this road until I get to the other side, but roof camper guy is, I think, peeking me. Is he? Yeah, 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 he is. Dude, people are so boring when they play like this. I think he got headshot by him as well. I could be totally wrong. When people get AKs and Bolties and half the server is still roaming around with crossbows and revies and there's just a few people with SARS, you should probably get out your base and PvP with your AK. And Bolty. You can even bring that too. But yeah, the body fell right behind, so I'm gonna grab whatever's here. Well, I got your stuff. Good enough, I guess. Look at him. He's still on his roof. That is a yikes. What, what, what was that? I, I, have, I have no idea what that gun was. That sounded deep. Was that a python or was that like some big boy gun? Oh, it was the, literally just a python and it's gonna... Okay. I got it. More syringes. Has he... There was one other dude over here that I think you killed. Oh, wait. Is that a person? Oh, that is a person. Wait, you never died. Alright, well, what did you have? This. Uh, let's throw that out. Got the SAR. All right, uh, I guess we'll run back to base. Right, we made it. Let's get a pickaxe and get all the sulfur as it's nighttime. So we have a supply signal. We need to use that eventually. There we go. I forgot to research that as well. Let's get some sulfur. Right, one more will do the trick. I think I'm going to go ahead and do the oil rig again. The small one to start off because I don't want to bring out my bolty. And I also don't want to lose my only AK because I can't craft another. Uh, let's bring this over to the base. Right, we've made it home. Let's get inside. And then let's put this explosive ammo here. Only 125 to research. Okay, well, let's research that then. Uh, well, now we are able to raid officially. We just need to make a level three workbench. And then we're really officially ready to raid. All right, let's do the small oil rig. This guy right over there. 
Looks like he might be a farmer. I said that because I saw him whip out some sort of pig. Oh, he's farming barrels. He's dead. You have a Revy. I don't care about that. You have quite- Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, yeah, you do have a lot of stuff on you. Uh, I guess- I guess we should depot real quick. Uh, I'm gonna- Oh. That guy blended in so well with the ground behind him. I could barely see him, but I got him. Uh, that's definitely gonna attract a lot of people over, so... Do you have syringes? Uh, and I'll take the springs. Damn it, again, shooting the AK way too close to my neighbor who has an AK and I don't want him to find out where I live because he will raid me. Uh, it looks like we'll be okay though, right? I think, yeah. All right, we're good. That's surprising. The other guy didn't even bother unless he's not online anymore. Time to get out again. We only have a few slots for inventory, but I'm sure we'll get shot at while we're there. So it's all good. Let's do this. Oh god, I was itching my arm. Oh, thank god, I killed him. Okay, that was awkward, dude. Oh, brother. <laughs> I'm not gonna finish him because he thinks I'm someone else. He said, I found you fancy, so he thinks I'm them. I'm gonna run away, pretend like I was never there, alright? And he'll never know who killed him. Too many syringes, dude. Alright, you know what? Let's store some. This is too much. Oh, there's another. Or he was just in a fight because he was healing. If he's broke, I'm not going to grab anything. What do you have? Oh, you're kind of loaded. Are you kidding me, dude? Time to run away. He doesn't know who I am either. All right, time for plan B. We're going this way this time. Let's go again. <laughs> There's a rib. Oh, no. oh. So I guess that's how it looks like when a rib spawns in. I'm going to grab this boat first to get that rib. That is uh, pretty interesting. I don't actually need the rib to just go there, but it did cover me really well last time when I was in a fight. Oh, wait. It actually looks like somebody's on it. I don't see any scientists. Somebody is definitely on it. Oh, God. Oh, God. He called in the heavy scientist. Dude, no. He actually did this to me. Dude, you got to be kidding me. Oh, someone's outside. Guys, I think he's dead. Will they come? Ch Can I get that body without getting killed? Oh my god, they're running over. Okay, there's a minicopter. Uh, any fuel? Yes. Alright, I don't know if I can grab that dude's body, but what I'll do is I'll go on the shore and try to get another rib, and I'll try to get there. I don't know if this will be possible, though. There's one right here, so I'll just get that one. Alright, we're on this. Let's get this guy some fuel. It's around here somewhere. I don't actually see it. Might have been a little bit more to the left. There it is. Can I actually reach it though? I'm gonna do a strat right here. I'm actually gonna back up into it. So if it starts shooting, we can just bolt. There it is, right behind me. But can I grab it? Oh my god, he's so loaded. I do need to come back with this. Oh, oh, we're getting shot at. No, start driving. Well, I don't know what weapon he had, but it doesn't matter. We're gonna be okay. We're gonna be okay. Don't worry, C and D. At least they don't make you bleed. If they made you bleed, then I think that would be GG's. The ladder hatch has always been like super rare for me at least, but I'm not really gonna research it because I don't need it. Oh, okay, that's straight ahead. He is so lucky I didn't kill him. All right, let's get inside. Well, anyways, uh, that was a super good run. We are very loaded. I don't know what to do. Like, all of my boxes are kind of full at the moment. How much is it? Is it actually... Yeah, it is 500. We'll have enough after we recycle this stuff, but then we really need to get a level 3. Instead of just simply going to the bandit camp, because I did shoot at somebody right outside of it and maybe a few minutes ago, uh, I'm just going to go to our train yard, and maybe we can even kill somebody who's farming scrap. That would be really good. Yeah, no one's here. It got completely looted not long ago, though. Is that my base? Yeah, that, that could actually be my base. All right, 125 scrap in total. Let's get out. I think I'm okay. I think I just panicked a little bit. Yeah, I'm okay. All right, I thought I really, I really, really thought I was getting raided right now. So I guess I should take that as a, a wake up call that I should probably make my entire base metal. I'm just a little bit afraid to do that to bring attention. So I may hold off on that until I actually get garage doors or something like that. I just think it'd be a bad idea to metal up this base. Okay, well, we got the bolty researched. Now we have 100 scrap. That's what we're starting with. And we need 1,250 for the level 3 workbench. So that is our next uh, item to work up to. 
And when I do get it, I'll literally just expand the base a little bit and add a uh, airlock for the level three workbench. I guess when I do do that, then I can metal up the entire base because obviously there's gonna be a noticeable difference to the base. Oh, I see him. And we're dead, rip. All right, we're ready to roam. I guess, uh, oh, cargo's out. Damn, dude, I don't even have my AK though. Well, I do wanna go to that, so we gotta do it. Let's do it. Ooh, looks like we're gonna get lucky with a nice old rib over there. That should help us quite a bit get on that cargo ship over there. We will get absolutely pooped on if somebody's already, oh, someone's already there. And there's a guy with a rib right there, uh-oh. Well, I'm gonna try to get on. Hopefully this guy doesn't have a bolty or something, so if he does, then we're so dead. A little bit of lag, which is pretty typical. No, I forgot you can't click E on it. Oh, oh my God, I'm on. Killed one. All right, you have full metal, I think. I don't know, no, you don't, you have copy can. Custom, oh wait, you do, kind of. All right, well, let's wear that and swap this. We now have a custom. Well, I'm not sure if anybody's on here. I think there is. I'm just gonna keep doing this and uh, I'm gonna get all the crates because if not, this boat will despawn without anybody grabbing the crates. Elite crate. Oh, C4 out of an elite crate. I did not know that was possible. Uh, Well, we got a C4 and we have explosives at base so we can do C4 raids. Dude, that would be actually really, really good if we could do C4 raids. Oh, there's a scientist down there. Oh, there's one of them. 15 minutes. And now we're in that situation of just having way too much recyclables. That is a moving crate. I want it. Oh, I didn't grab it. Rip. Another elite crate. Uh, I guess I'll sacrifice this. Won't really need it. I'm unable to find the two other crate. Oh. Oh. The other one should be right up front. No, but there's an elite crate. Dude, since when do they have elite crates? At least as many as these, this is insane. I don't care about the MP5. I'm gonna throw that out. Oh. Oh, that was way too close. Way too close, dude. There's the other crate. Well, if we're lucky, we might be able to get all of them, but we're super limited on uh, inventory space, so that might be an issue. We have C4s, which is just amazing. And like I said, we have explosives at base, so we can research both of those and just go on a C4 raiding spree. So much high qual, and we actually really need it. That aimbot though. We have 424 scrap and we haven't recycled a single thing. The first one I did was this one over here, I think. Yeah, nine minutes. We are about to find out what is in this crate. Give me five AKs, 10 C4s, please. Another C4, I'll take it. And we got a metal chest piece, noise. Oh, armor double doors, dude. Okay, um, now we can actually armor up our base. I'm gonna throw that out. I'm gonna throw this there and this there. We're not armor it all up, but I can actually make it metal. Well, I guess since we'll be doing C4 raids, we don't really need this bean can. Uh, let's get to the top or the other one is over here, I think. 53 seconds. Where's the other one? Oh, oh, wait, it just finished. I don't even know where it is. Yeah, yeah, it's at the front, I remember. Okay, rocket launcher. Yikes, we don't have any rockets, so it's not gonna be any useful. Uh, we have way too many things on us. Rocket launcher, absolutely do want. I'll put that on this. Don't care about the M92. This would save us from doing a lot of crafting. I guess we'll just dump that. Uh, and then metal chest plate, we will replace it with 20 pipes. Then there's the last one, which is right here. And we got another rocket launcher. You gotta be kidding me, dude. I don't have space like this. And we can grab this. The Tommy would be kind of cool though. Here, I can just swap it like that. There we go. Oh my God. Talk about an inventory. Now we have to escape. We have three armored doors, which we'll be adding to the base. We'll be honeycombing the entire thing, meddling it all up. There's a whole list of things that I'm gonna be doing. Uh, let's get the heck out of here. Let's go. Now, the fun part is, is that I don't need to research any of these. I'm just going to replace all the double doors because I only have three. We made it. GG's. Uh, actually, let me see. How much is this recite or research? Yikes, that is 500 scrap. Instead, I'm going to research this right now. So this is 500 
scrap to research. And then down here we have an explosive, which is another 500 scrap. By the time we get a level 3 workbench, we're going to have all the BPs. It's kind of ridiculous. Why is he shooting my base? Uh, and then there's this that I need to research. That's another 500 scrap. Well, that's not going to be anytime soon, unfortunately. Because I do want to get a level 3 before I even get a rocket launcher researched. Uh, Alright, let's get these doors replaced. Uh, this is going to be very difficult, actually. Before I do that, I'm going to put my loot away. All of this high qual, we can literally make AKs for days and armor for days. Once we actually, you know, get a level 3 workbench set up. When you think upgrading a base, you would imagine that replacing the doors would be the easy part. No, it, it is not the easy part. This actually ended up taking me a solid 20 to 30 minutes just to do the inside of my base. Because I pretty much had to replace everything in order to place down my doors. But once I finished that, I did add a little bit to the base at the front so that I could put down a level 3 workbench. Which I ended up doing next episode instead of this one since I didn't have enough scrap. As well as that, I ended up honeycombing the entire base. Uh, I kept everything on the exterior to stone not to bring any attention to us and also to make it seem like you know we're not that rich but in the inside i did upgrade everything to metal so yeah once i got done fully upgrading my base i did go out for the next 30 minutes to just pvp and do whatever i could here is that part all right let's go do a tiny recycle run a tiny one that'll actually give me a lot of scrap all right we're here no one else is here good 525 scrap we will then have the explosives researched we'll be left over with like a hundred scrap after that so i guess what we need to do is work our way up to a level three workbench and i think that will actually be it and by that i mean i don't think we have anything else to research after that at least not for a while unless we get you know rockets or something let's go ahead and research this thing there we go researched oh this guy's getting out Dude, I hate that. That's so lame. Oh, this guy goes inactive the entire time, and then all of a sudden... Oh, someone died outside. Now, I'm gonna guess that if he's gonna loot him, he's gonna come back up here, but I could be wrong, because I think he did die. But yeah, yeah, yeah. He's coming. He's definitely hearing me. He's not reacting. I downed him. There we go. Let's grab it before this guy respawns and comes kill me. Got an AK. Alright, I'm just gonna leave. Um, alright, we made it. Okay, well, we just banked an AK, plus we have an extra gear set. GG's. But yeah, that is where this episode ends off. I hope you guys did want to enjoy. There are still three more episodes left after this one, and trust me, they get pretty insane. But yeah, thank you all for watching. I appreciate it, and that's pretty much it. Peace.